home are the young heroes of science. After a weekend of reflection on their overall triumph at the BT Young Scientists and Technology Exhibition, Liam Carew and Shane O'Connor were back at school today. Their project focused on the impact of second level education on adolescent development and proved timely. School definitely has a very positive impact on students. Social interaction was the most heavily impacted area among students with rating the lowest and this directly correlates with students' mental health and physical health and we saw luckily that as we move out of COVID times this, this uh, student's experience of this is improving. It was a first win at this level for the Abbey School and the work was backed all the way by the staff. If our students in fact are, you know, um, I suppose being physically challenged, um, we actually see that there is increase in their mental well-being as well as their social interaction with other students, which is really, really important for the development of um, the student as a whole. The appreciation for the support that school has for young people uh, throughout their lives, particularly in those formative years when they're in secondary school, you know, is really significant. And students miss that during the, the, the COVID experience. And now that we're coming out of it, the significance of it is all the more uh, pronounced, I think, for young people. They understand themselves now how important it is and they express that in the survey. And the winners say their research could prove useful for others. We hope to talk to the Department of Education because they're the policy makers at the end of the day. Um, as well as that, you have policy advisors such as the ESRI and other organisations. But as well as that, it can be implemented at a grassroots level. Later in the year, they will represent Ireland at the EU Contest for Young Scientists. Conor Kane, RT News, Tipperary.